Hi friends. Today's travels are from Pacacho Peak State Park, north of Tucson, up into the mountains to Globe, Arizona, with a stop at the Travel America uh, truck stop to get some diesel fuel. Let's go. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. So we're about to turn off onto Highway 60 towards Globe, and it should start to get pretty real soon because we're going up. We have some 6 and 8% grades to pull, and uh, this might be a tough drive. Yep, it's going to get pretty. We're going to go through a town called Miami, Miami, Arizona. And right close to there is referred to as the top of the world. I have a Cummings 350 turbocharged diesel. And the turbocharger is kicking in. Yes, of course, I blew my air horns in the tunnel. Glad to see those big boys towing. There's another one. It means that whatever's ahead, I can probably make it through. And as the old saying goes, what goes up must come down. I actually prefer going uphill. Um, have an engine problem or something, can always uh, pull over. Going downhill, brakes fail, not good. And up we go again. Wow, look at those spires. We must be getting close to the top of the world. Uh-oh, what's going on here? Cars stopped in the road. Hmm. Oh, I think it's construction. Well, cars coming through now. At least the road is not blocked ahead. They just have it cut down to one lane, so we're waiting for everybody else to get out of the way. And finally, it's our turn to go. Uh-oh, bridge. Lynn doesn't like bridges. She'll be hiding her head like an ostrich, Bridge of the Gods in Oregon, she'd crawl under the dash, literally. Hey, Lynn, I'm editing the video between Picacho Peak and Globe. Do you remember that bridge? Yes, I After do. After the traffic jam with the uh, construction? Yes, I do. Did you like that bridge? No, I didn't. Do you like any bridge? No. What was the worst bridge? The worst bridge was 
in New York City when we were on the Verrazano Narrows. Verrazano Narrows. And you were driving and had a camera up and were taking video and driving on the bridge and I just went crazy on you. Yep, you went buck. <laughs> I went buck. I said, don't you ever do that again or I'll never get in the car with you. Did I ever do it again? Yes. Did you get in the car with me? Yes. Do you regret it? Do I regret it? Yeah. No. Miami, Arizona. Well, I didn't really expect to see palm trees in Arizona. I'm going to pull over here for a minute and stop. The nice thing about driving a big Class A motorhome is that when you absolutely have to rest, you don't need to rest stop. You can pull over and all you need is a parking place. Got some old buildings here. I suspect this is an old mining town, considering we're up in a high altitude place in Arizona where a lot of mining was done back in the day. Next stop, Globe, Arizona. Diesel 5.25 a gallon. That's uh, about uh, 30 cents a gallon less than it was at the Travel America truck stop back there on the freeway. Fortunately, I have an EFS card from TSD Logistics in Texas, which gives me a diesel discount of about 80 cents uh, back there at that fill-up. And by the way, that's 80 cents a gallon for diesel. Check it out if you're interested. Well, I kind of misspoke. We're not going to actually make it to Globe this afternoon. We're only going to make it right over there. Wait for it. Taco Bell. Hamburger Ding Dong. Yeah, we're going to stop there and get some lunch. Well, we're at a big Walmart here. It's not Globe, it's just the next little town that's actually part of the city called Claypool, Claypool, Arizona. Looks like they're building a new store there. And here we are. Uh, I can't go through the drive-thru, obviously. So I'm going to park right here and do a walk-through. Enjoying the last warm, sunny days here, my shorts and sandals. Little did I know, there's snow in my future very shortly. Well, after a couple of tacos, we decided that we would just stay here, 
at this Walmart parking lot for the evening, even though it's only like about uh, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. It's going to be a hard 111 miles straight ahead on into Sholo. So we're going to just spend the night here. Taco Bell tacos. You know, you can't get hard-shelled tacos in Mexico. It's just a foreign concept. And Taco Bell isn't my favorite, but it's better than nothing. Our favorite for hard-shelled tacos is Taco John's up in South Dakota. This is a big parking lot. I've already walked this to see where I want to park. And it's way over here on this side. Plus, I did call them. I called and said, uh, can I stay overnight? They said, yes, you certainly can. Please don't park where they're building the new store and go over here by the grass. So, we're going over here. There's a, a friendly and this will be our parking place for the evening. You know, I'm editing this after the fact, and it turns out that the traffic here, what's that crawling up my windshield? Whoa. It turns out that the traffic here was really noisy. I believe that this town has more loud mufflers than any place I've been. Plus, I'm pretty sure that all of the locals, as they leave Walmart, go through the gears just to annoy the campers parked here at the Walmart. Well, it's a good night. Tomorrow's going to be a good day. Another mountainous drive and reported to be uh, 12 miles of pretty serious up and down hills. Steep grades. Well, we'll make it. See you tomorrow. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.